very athletic play, and I loved that shit. I loved it specifically to go over the linebacker's head. Forgive me if I sound a little funny in this video, man. I'm fucking sick. Everybody in the in the house is sick. Me, and my girl, and my son. <laughs> I don't know. We got allergies, a little bit of a cold. You know, we kind of fucked up, but things must go on. So here we go, man. If you've been following the series for a while, you know Notre Dame is a rivalry game for us. I believe I've actually lost to them twice, man. Hang on. So check it out. This is our head coach, Sean Coogler. He's really just the front man. Flimlo Raps runs everything from behind the scenes, but I need him just to talk to the media, you know, shake hands, kiss babies, that type of thing. Cause me and the media, you know, it just wouldn't work. Anyway, five years at UTEP, 71 and four. 71 and four. Now factor this in. Two of those losses are the notion that. Ain't that some shit? <laughs> so with that being said, let's go back to the screen real quick. I'm spending a little extra time here because this is very important. This is a big game. We have a solid team. You can see Notre Dame has an amazing team, but they're not without weaknesses, which we're gonna talk about in one second. We're ranked number seven. We got one loss. They're ranked number one. They're undefeated, okay? If we lose this game, the chances for us to get all the way back to the national championship are going to be very difficult, not impossible, but very difficult. Whereas if we win this game and win out, I think we can still control our own destiny. Y'all already know we gotta go white out for this. I mean, I need white everything, let's go. All right, here's the deal. Okay, of course we're missing our starting quarterback. We've been playing without him for weeks now, we're good. Notre Dame is missing their starting quarterback and their starting running back, and they have a corner that's out. Uh, the quarterback is like a 96, running back's a 99, and that corner is only 85. So you look at that and you're like, yeah, we're good. I'll remind you, the last time we lost to Notre Dame, they had their backup quarterback starting. And then we played them later that year, I think in the Natty actually, yeah, in the National Championship. They brought the starter back in and we bust their ass. <laughs> you know, we destroyed them in the National Championship. So not only is this a rivalry game for us, not only is this huge, it's a National Championship rematch, man. All right, man, so they won the coin toss and they're gonna hold up. Boom! They're kicking it off to us, man, let's get it. Be opening it up, man. Let's go. Right, we're going to open this thing up with the triple option. Oh, bruh. I tried to time that shit for when he jumped on my back, but they didn't let me, uh, I guess I hit it too late. All right, man. So, <laughs> already we got a third and long. Y'all know what time it is. Damn it, man. So... That's obviously not the way we wanted to start the game with a fucking three and out. And this is going to be the difference anyway in the game. Let's go, Davis. Come on, Davis. It's not good enough to have good coverage. It's not good enough. You got to make the fucking play, dog. This big. Pick. Let's go. <laughs> he throws it to absolutely nobody. I switched to Scott Ward. Two picks dropped. Now, I give Scott Ward a pass. You know, I give him a break because he can't catch. He's a big hitter. But my corners, come on, man. Y'all gets no pass. I ain't trying to hear that shit. All right, man, let's go. A Tony Garcia sighting. Nobody's going to block that guy. Oh, they did. They actually blocked him. Oh, I thought he was coming out of that. All right. All right, we did not gain one yard. Last time. Actually, I don't think they gained the yard either. So, <laughs> the defenses, don't, man. And I'm gonna just, I gotta give them so much love because every time we play them, this is the case. All right, check this out. So, the hole that I'm supposed to run in, you'll see it develop. There it is. There's a linebacker in it. You know what I mean? So, I'm like, okay, let's try to get outside. The second I try to get outside, he breaks off his block. Now I'm fucked. You know what I mean? <laughs> Now I got nowhere to go. I mean, ultimately, I, some people just gotta have to make plays, bro. You know what I'm saying? That's what it's gonna come down to. Let's go. 
Hey, Livingston does a great job in that middle, man. You know, he reminds me of uh, Walker. Remember Walker? As far as, every time I try to run the ball, I've lost yards. Like, that's crazy. All right, they got one high. I love it. We're going to run a curl with somebody. 50-yard field goal. We hit one of these last game, so I don't see why we couldn't just do it again right here. I didn't get everything on it and I needed everything. Like I was right there, but I didn't quite get it filled up. He's not down, bro. Let's go. Good job by their quarterback, making a run, breaking a tackle. Damn. There we go, Scott. I'm like, I'm not switching. You're Scott Ward. You got to make that play. I got to stay in coverage on this post route. Like that quarterback break tackle gotta be a 99. All right, Adrian Wall makes a play, let's go. They can't get theirs to go. I catch it, barely. I got It's like, I didn't think that I had actually caught it because I was like, damn, okay, it's coming. I got to try to catch it. And I, I timed it perfect, but I thought I timed it wrong. So I ended up running backwards and forward, but we still ended up getting a, a few yards off of that. So I'll take it. All right, man. We got one high. I'm going to try my luck real quick. I'm going to try my luck real quick. Let's go. Huh? Let's go, baby. All right, man, one of my favorite plays in this situation, the goal line. I got a scotter with fullback. We just run the nice little, <laughs> nice little strong power money. It fucked me up because that should have been a pick. All that dancing, man. We just stay at home, wait till he finish dancing, and knock his ass out. I guess the way he see it, he getting positive yards, getting a manageable third down. Let's go, Scott. Hell yeah. Yeah. All right, you're able to knock that one back. Tell y'all right now, this is going to be a little bit of a gamble, but, you know, whatever. Let's go. <clears throat> Damn, they playing that shit so good, dude. All right, Price got left wide open. We threw it up with the noodle arm, but he was so open, made the catch anyway. Bro. Cause he know, he know his bitch ass was tackled. Hancock throws a wild fucking pass. Cause Escado's open, who I'm throwing it to. We don't, we're not leaning or anything. We stop. Throw the ball. He throws a fucking wild pass directly to their safety. Like, that's the type of shit. Like, we can't. We just can't, man. Sky Ward, baby. He's got to fumble that. Oh, 
all over that shit. All right, man. Third down and go. Let's get it. And we called the timeout, baby. Okay, they were so close. I call myself super simming the, that field goal, but looks like they went for it and we got a pick. So <laughs> they get no points off of that. So that's hell yeah. Let's go. Here we go. Here we go. Let's move it. Let's move it. Very athletic play, and I love that shit. I loved it specifically to go over the linebacker's head. Bitch! Let's go. Got Ward came to play, dog. He came to play, man. Let's go. Come on, Davis. Come on, Davis. That was an amazing play. Right, they are really, really shutting down the Scotto because they're the way that they're playing their defense. It's really not allowing us to use it. See how they're bracketing the shit out of them? Oh, let's go! Baby, <laughs> Victor Price, who I just called overrated last game with the biggest play of his life. Dude, this, this. Because I wanted to go to Liston, you know what I mean? But we're going to clearly see the safeties like, nah, you ain't going to Liston. So this side of the field is wide open. I have no more time. I got to throw it right here. I'm getting here. All right, throw it up. And Price, man, he does a great job of, let's go, let's go to him. A great, because this is great coverage. Great job of getting positioning. Okay, cool. Going up, making the catch. Now, not only does he make the catch, dude falls down. Now he's just become a football player. Check him out, bro. Breaks a tackle, stays in bound, and then drags this guy in the end zone, dog. I mean, that is the biggest play. That's been the biggest play in a very long time. That shit was huge, man. Now, the fact that we was able to score right there at the end of the half is, is so damn huge because they got the ball right now. We knew they were getting that half. Pick! Oh, come on, bro. Pick, ah, okay, better, better. That's my freshman over there. Dude, oh, he still got that first down. What the, f man, going for two right here. Let's go. We're gonna double up. We're gonna double up. Let's go, Liv. They got three people sitting right there. Like, they be doing exactly what I'm calling them, dude. Can't get a Scotto to go up for that, man. Like, he got the size and everything. He just doesn't jump. Third down and five, y'all. All 
I jumped that shit too fast and I couldn't make the pick, but we do make the play. So they're not accounting for price and living state. Let's go. All right, we haven't been able to stop them on third down really at all, like the entire game. Cause that fluke shit started happening. He starts stumbling and then he breaks a tackle. You know what I mean? God damn, eh? But I have to pass because they're just completely taking the run game away. All right, baby. Let's go, Sam. I mean, you can't just stop blocking, dog. I mean, he'll basically get there, make contact, and then just stop. Like, all right, I'm done. All right, bro. Huge, huge third down right here. <clears throat> Got Ant wide open. I, I wasn't even looking for him that time. I was looking for the underneath. But while he was taking forever, I looked back up. Thank God I did because Ant was wide open. They're out of timeouts, it's second down. They're gonna give us the touchdown. <clears throat> we'll take it because of how much we are up by. Come on, Davis. Again, bro, beautiful coverage. Beautiful, co he's shut down. He is absolutely shut down over there. But, you know what I'm saying? We just keep giving him more and more and more chances. That's the problem. Well, we can just end that shit. Let's go, baby. Adrian Wall loves to fall down when the kid like it's, the play not over, man. <laughs> I'm like I'm like the most difficult guy to please. Great pick, man. You continue to not be able to run the ball. All right, man. That's the game. Was not pretty offensively. And, you know, going forward, we really got to take a look at that quarterback position. But we ain't going to talk about that right now. We're just going to enjoy the victory versus Notre Dame. This was huge for us. And you can see game deadlocked the entire game. But we won the fourth quarter. We won the game. Here we go. So looking at the QB, man, honestly, he was really, he was actually very good. I mean, 20 of 29, 353 yards. He just had, I think, like one wild throw that was a pick. No, two, I'm lying. No, no, he had one wild throw that was a pick. One where the linebacker made an amazing play, and the other one was Scott wouldn't go up. So it's just like, and they made, they took advantage of all their fucking chances. We dropped all our picks, they caught all theirs. So, you know, it's, uh, Either way, my receivers got off, man. Victor Price finally showed up. Five catches, 124 yards, and a touchdown. Livingston Ball, five catches, 61 yards. Liston Ball, four catches, 98. Moscato did not have as good a game as he's been having, but still had four catches for 54 yards and a touchdown. Jeremy Robinson leading the team, 11 tackles. Scott Ward right behind him with eight. Scott Ward had the only sack of the day. 
Adrian Wall had the only pick of the day. And let's look at these deflections. Look, these are drop picks, except maybe one. Davis dropped three picks. You know what I mean? Adrian Wall dropped one. Jeremy got actually swatted. You see, you see all these guys. <laughs> like, that's crazy. Those are all would-be turnovers. That's six turnovers that we left out there. But either way, we beat Notre Dame, so we're definitely going to jump back up in the rankings a little bit. All we got to do is keep this thing going. We'll be back in the national championship. Click the thumbs up button if you enjoyed the video. My name is Flemlo Raps. Wow.